What's up, guys? Well, I got the computer build finished. Uh, what we got here is uh, the Corsair H50 water cooling setup. I have it uh, set up as a push pull fan configuration. I have it exhausting out the top of my case because that's the only, I only have one fan that's exhausting air. So if I had it sucking air in, like I said, uh, the air would have nowhere to go and all my shit would overheat. And that would not be good. So, it's cooling a, uh, a Phenom X4 955 quad core. Then back there we got our two 9800 GX2s and quad SLI. Uh, can't really see the RAM, but there's 4 gigabytes of DDR3-1600 ADATA RAM in there. And I just got done installing Windows 7 last night. So let's turn that on and... See what's what. Well, so far I, I like Windows 7. It's definitely a lot faster than Vista was. Uh, only thing is, I uh, so far. I only installed a couple games, but I cannot for the life of me get Crisis to work at all. I don't know if anybody else knows how, or if I'm just doing something wrong, but I've tried a bunch of different uh, updates for it, patches that say it's Windows 7 patches. Still will not load. Right after the it gets done with its loading screen, it just sits there as a black screen, no matter what. So, if anybody knows how to fix that, that would be great. Other than that, all I put on there was uh, Counter Strike, car, Counter Strike Source, stuff like CPUZ, Zerius, AIM, stuff like that. So if I can get Crisis working, I'll run some benchmarks. But yeah. Alright, so uh, I'll definitely make another video when I start uh, overclocking it. So uh, until then, uh, peace out guys.